Mean and moody men. <laughs> At least it's the concentration before competition. Matthias Jons of Sweden. Runner up in the championships, in fact, uh, and he's also had a couple of national titles to his credit. The Hungarian. Always amongst uh, the leading lights in the hammer, Christian Paz. Fourth in the World Championships last year and also in the Olympic Games uh, before that. And from Poland indeed, a former Olympic champion, Simon Ziolkowski. Been one of the most consistent throwers for a decade. Perhaps a, a newer name. Uh, Igor Vinichenko had a disappointing World Championship final last year in Berlin that failed to register a mark. That, that really is uh, ignominy for Vinichenko. Christoph Nemeth of Hungary. One of the younger throwers got to the final of the under 23s in Europe last year. Kajalainen of Finland. Uh, something was surprised when he got uh, European silver four years ago. Belarusian and the Belarusians have a wonderful tradition in this uh, event. Valeri Sviatoka. And the second of the Poles in this final. Wojciech uh, Kondratovic. And this man has been the tops in Europe for all through the year. In fact, the tops in the world. Libor Kafreitag of Slovakia. From France, Nicolas Figère. One of the veterans here. 37 years of age now, still throwing well. Nicola Bissoni of Italy. And I'll just add my plaudits to what you may have heard on our effects mic from the public address. Indeed, he was the Olympic silver medalist. That was way back in Sydney 10 years ago. And the last man in this lineup, not necessarily going to be last in the finishing order from Ukraine, Oloksiy Sikorsky. Christian Paz in the Hammer final. <laughs> Terrific movement in the circle from Paz. Number three in Europe this season, so every hope of medals. Tsiolkovsky, uh, perhaps I might s dare I say, isn't as old as he looks. He's actually 34. <laughs> he looks as if uh, he's been around for a long time. And what do you know? Uh, you wait for one pole and another one turns up straight away. Kondratovic. He's veering off to the uh, left, but safely within the throwing area. The strong men of Poland are out in support. 
Very delicate movements also that the uh, hammer throwers need. They're not just about strength, it's the timing. To be holding on to that hammer, and terrific uh, centrifugal force playing upon them. That's why they need to be so strong. The hammer final continues. Lots of effort from Christian Paz, and that's looking a big one. A little short of 80 meters for the Hungarian. Oh, that is way over. A roar from Paz, and that's a roar of defiance to his rivals, the new leader, Christian Paz of Hungary. What can Zielkowski of Poland do? The former Olympic champion, an immediate response is needed. He's currently in fourth. Whips that out a long way. Is it a foul? I think it's just inside the sector. From that mark, from that dent in the turf, it looks like Zilkowski has got a legal throw in. And it was long. But was it as long as Paz? I don't think so. Can he move up from fourth place? Men's hammer final continues. Jotka, Belarus. That's over the 75 meter mark. That could make things interesting for Vyotka. He's had a good series. There, his best so far in round two. That's big. That is even better from Libor Karp Freitag, the best in the world this year. And the Slovak shows why he's number one. Pizzoni, the grizzled veteran Italian left-hander, unusual in the throwers. And that's pretty good from Pizzoni. This final is hotting up. Not quite the range of uh, Karfreitag, but it'll do. It'll certainly put him amongst the top three. Vissoni has been around, been a, a top competitor for a decade and more. We are looking for Let's catch up with the hammer. Here's Vissoni, who just slipped down the rankings out of the medals. That left hander whipping the hammer out uh, just past the, the cage. Certainly putting some big throws together. currently in the silver medal position. Oh, and that, that could be crucial. His first foul of this final. And this is the leader who remains impassive, Libor Karfreitag. Thank you. 
Gar Freitag, his best so far has been in uh, round two, and he's the only man to go beyond 80 meters. Measured tread. Right, it's got that away. I thought it was going to be hitting the cage, but it's away. And our slow-mo really brings home the tremendous twist and torque on the upper body, indeed the going through the whole body. Sviatogova of Belarus. Is that going to be enough to get him into the medals? Whoa! <laughs> It's only thank you, thank you very much. dropped out of the top three. Oh, another big effort from the Italian. Yes, he's back among the medals. Nicola Vizzoni is back in the hunt for medals. And that is second place for Vizzone. He's got silver within his grasp. With his very last throw, Nicola Vizzone has claimed silver. But it's not over. Christian Paz of Hungary. Last round for both these men. And that caption says it all. Still, Karfreitag leads with his round two throw. Bissoni has moved into second. Paz currently in the bronze medal position. Whips it out, and is it going to improve? No. So Christian Paz will take the bronze medal. Fine competition from the Hungarian. His best coming in round two. He had only one foul, and that was in the previous round. So that sets it up for a victory throw <laughs> from Libor Karfreitag. And I think, yes, Karfreitag has decided to pass on his final round. He has the gold. He's the world number one this year. And now the European champion. 
<laughs> and uh, what do you know? What do you want to do? You want to ring home, message home, and say, our man has done it. Karl Freitag of Slovakia is the European Hammer champion. And what a performance from Nikola Vissoni at the age of 37. Yet another medal for him. Ten years after he took a silver in the Olympics in Sydney, Vissoni has another silver medal of his collection. Fine throwing two from Christian Pars, and that's the full lineup. Sviatoka of Belarus. It's not often that we uh, have a top three without a Belarusian in the men's hammer, but just beaten out of it. Ibo Freitag has been the number one throughout this season. 